But I'm around the front here. You can see I'm cutting a sprocket on the on the dividing head. Right, just zoom in a little bit for you. There we are. That's that's the sprocket we're cutting, and uh, that's worked out pretty good. Now we go around the side, and this this particular dividing head is 60 to one. So one turn on there. That's what we're doing. 60 turns on there gives you one on there. Now what I've done different, I've got floating dials, and I will zoom in so you can see all the calibrations that I put on. So I've got 360 degree of calibrations around there. Not very clear, I know, but it is on there. Right, there we are, that's a bit better. So what I did is, <coughs> you can flick that round <coughs> and it's easy. If you want a, just a straight dial up on the head, just use this calibration here and it's twice as quick, so you just flick it round. This one here is your fine calibrations, and on here I've divided this one up into 60 parts, and so that's nice and easy. Through the centre, there's a little who just down there, runs all the way through, and inside is a Morse taper 3. So I can take that out and I can replace it with the <coughs> oh, cough, uh, I can put inside the the other bits that I've got that fit in there, Morse taper, which is quite useful. Um, then that's the lock, and it's all homemade. Now, what I did on the end here, I cut this 60 degree wheel, and the the, the worm drive is actually, when I cut that, I used the maximum pitch on a 920 lathe, to give you some sort of idea. Works out pretty good. It fits that there, that's a 60 degree pitch on those for the teeth. <coughs> uh, and that was how I did it all. So, hopefully there's enough information there for you to build your own. It's not difficult. Um, if you can build this, you can build pretty well anything. So this is Dave signing off. We've got uh, bits at the bottom, don't forget. Uh, thumbs up or thumbs down. Or don't forget, sign up and uh, subscribe. And hit that old bell if you want to hear anything else later on. It's not all machine tools. Don't forget, we've still got the rocket stoves on there. So this is Dave, we'll catch you on the flip side.